Welcome everyone, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to easily screen record on your iOS 14 device. So all iPhones, all iPads and all iPod Touches are supported. However, you will need at least 700 megabytes of storage available on your iPhone if you want to record for more than, you know, five minutes. So I advise you go into settings, general, about, you can see I have, you know, just, just enough storage. But if, seriously, if you don't have more than 700 megabytes, you will not be able to screen record your device. So I advise you, you know, you're just going to have to free up storage or do something. So the process is extremely simple. Head over to the home page of settings. Then I want you to find control center. So it's just under general. Then scroll down and you see screen recording. Tap on plus and you can see we have screen recording now enabled. So this is the official Apple screen recorder. So it isn't a virus or whatever. And to activate it, find uh, the control center. So for me, I just swipe from the top right. For you, you might have to swipe up from the bottom. Depends if you have a notched iPhone or a home button iPhone. Then you will see this brand new button right here. So if you tap on it, you have a countdown and the recording starts. But you can also long press to see this sub view right here. So you have microphone off or on. If you turn on the microphone, it's going to capture um, audio from the mics. If you turn it off, it will only capture internal system audio. So if microphone is off, um, you will still be able to record your game audio. So do keep in mind, if your um, uh, volume mic right here is set to zero or your ringer switch is set to mute, so make sure you, uh, uh, you know, disable silent mode, then because if it's on or your volume's off, you'll not have any sound in the screen recording. So I advise you make sure your uh, silent mode is off, you make sure you have sound, then, uh, uh, you know, long press, Tap on start recording, you see a countdown, and then you can see the recording has started. Now on the iPhone 10 and newer, you have this red icon here. On older devices, you have a just a red bar that covers the entire screen, uh, top half, whatever. And um, essentially, it's going to capture every movement you do. So if I open up this app, this app, everything is being captured right now. And to stop the screen recording, just tap on the red icon or bar. Tap on stop and you can see screen recording save the photos. Now, if you lock your device, um, the screen recording will fail to save. And this only applies to if you're recording for more than, you know, 10 minutes because I recorded for 10 seconds, so it processed right away. However, if you are recording for 10 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour, two hours, you will need to stay on the home screen or in other applications until you see that notification because if you go to the lock screen, the screen recording will fail to save onto your device. So once you get that notification, you can go into photos, continue, and now you can see a live playback. So you can see, um, is it playing? Yep, it is playing. And very soon you're going to see the swipes that I do and all that good stuff. So this is probably when I was explaining things. So you can see the swipes. You can see it's basically replicating what I just did earlier. So very simple to do if you want to enable mic audio you will hear that but just make sure inside of photos that you see this uh, right here you enable audio so you can hear it and that's how to screen record on ios 14 hopefully you enjoy bye bye